day, I want your touch In every way, I can't give it up Anything, just to feel the rush This just ain't enough hi guys thank you for stopping by and thank you so much for clicking on this video if you are new here my name is christine i'm a mother of three twins that are four years old and dad uh, and uh, my firstborn daughter who is turning 12 years uh, next month. So uh, today's video is all about cleaning and this is how I do my cleaning every morning whether I'm leaving the house or I'm just indoors here. Yeah, this is a must do every morning before uh, breakfast. Yeah, I do. I always do my cleaning before breakfast. So I always start with the dishes. I just clear the dish rack because my daughter cleans the dishes in the evening and uh, sometimes she doesn't collect all the dishes to clean and uh, they wake up early morning to go to school so the utensils that are used uh, by them in the morning are always in the sink and also she always leaves uh, the sufuria that we use to make the pot actually that we use to make ugali in the sink uh, soaked here yeah. so I have to clear up everything uh, this kitchen and just leave it clean uh, every every morning guys so that is what i'm doing so welcome to this channel thank you so much for being here and uh, please don't forget to like share and leave a comment down below guys and uh, also uh, let me know in the comment section how you do your morning cleaning yeah if you always uh, take breakfast before cleaning or if you prefer uh, keeping the house clean before uh, breakfast guys So there's always tea in the flask that is left. I always don't like to keep tea in the flask the whole day. So I just pour it in a, in a jug. Yeah, and I will cover that jug so that I just clip, keep this uh, flask clean. Yeah, most of mostly this flask nowadays, if you keep the tea there the whole day, uh, it tends to uh, change its, te its taste. Yeah, so because I don't take breakfast these days in the morning, I just prefer pouring the tea in the jug jug and i will warm it uh in the evening when they return or when i whenever i want to take the tea i will just warm it uh, and take it <music>
after wiping all the countertops are clean i just go ahead and mop and this day i decided to use a mopper because guys yeah my stomach was not behaving and i was uh, driving actually yeah uh, i woke up early morning driving so i wasn't feeling that better but uh, yeah i had to do what i got to do and uh, work has to go on in this house The next room I like keeping organized and clean is their bedroom. Yeah, so they wake up and go to school and just leave their beds like that. At times, Nicolette uh, makes her bed whenever she wakes up earlier. But uh, today she was a bit late and uh, so she was in a hurry and she just left. She always, uh, she's supposed to be seated in class by 6.30. Yeah, so she leaves the house at 6 uh, sharp. Yeah, so I ha I have to make their beds though. They, are, they had changed their beddings and um, I'm not going to change any bedding so I will wipe off this uh, study desk of hers and then I will just make uh, their bed Another thing that I always make sure I do is uh, removing this uh, rug here and just flip it so that uh, all the dust uh, is out. Yeah, uh, it it retains a lot of dirt. Yeah, even when the kids are not here the whole day, I don't know why. If the dust comes from the windows, I'm not sure. Yeah, but. Uh, uh, in this bedroom, the kids tear papers, they do whatever they want to do in this room. At times, you leave it clean, and when they are from school, you'll just find uh, some pieces picked from outside there, and they are dumped here. Papers are torn everywhere. Yeah, even Nicolette at her age, she, st she still tears papers. Uh, papers and just do her thing as a kid yeah so i always like cleaning it every morning just removing that rug and uh, clean it to maintain it one one thing i promised myself when i was making this room when i was uh doing a makeover of this room is that this room has to be clean every day guys yeah so i really try my best though once in a while when they are uh, on holidays you will get it uh, you will get it messy but um, I always tell Nicolette to make sure that this room is a bit organized and not that shaggy Oh my, we've been fucking all 
The next room that must be cleaned is their toilet. Yeah, they use this toilet every day. I rarely, I rarely use this toilet, guys. So I just have to wash their toilet. Uh, so I'm soaking uh, their toilet with the toilet soap. And then I will go ahead and clean their sink. They use this sink every morning to brush their teeth, to wash their hands. Yeah, so I have to clean it. And any visitor that comes here uses this sink and this toilet. So I have to make sure that uh, this area is clean even not sparkling clean but it's a uh, clean and uh, smelling fresh So I was trying to fix this uh, soap holder but it was not behaving. I, th I think it needed a screw. It has become so loose and uh, the uh, tissue oil holder also became loose and came off and we never returned it guys. But I think I'll just buy other new stuff to replace these things in this toilet here. So next is my bedroom. I'm just going to open up the curtains. Yeah, so whenever I wake up in the morning, I just go straight to prepare to wake up the kids and uh, prepare them for school. So I don't get busy with opening up the curtains because I always know I will do that later when they have left. So uh, the first thing I do here is just to open my curtains and then make my bed. I'm not going to change any beddings, guys. Yeah, I'm just going to straighten up my bed because these beddings are clean they were changed uh just uh two days ago My kids come in this bedroom a lot so it has to be mopped at least yeah on areas that are visible yeah so that is what i'm doing right now so for my master bathroom uh, when i finish up with the cleaning normally i i go to shower yeah and uh, when i finish showering uh, that is when i just uh, clean it up and leave it uh, clean yeah That basket there has dirty clothes and uh, yeah, nowadays I don't get to pile a lot of clothes. I wash clothes twice a week these days. Yeah, so those ones will be washed probably tomorrow. Yeah.
I also get to flip this carpet just to make sure that uh, all the dust is uh, yeah is off it because uh, you know runners carry a lot of dust because this is uh, the area that people pass a lot while going to each and every uh, room of this house here. Yeah. So I have to make sure it's dust free and then just go ahead and mop uh, this space. So my living room normally doesn't have a lot to do so I, the only thing I need to do is just open the curtains and then I will go ahead and wipe uh, dust from all the furnitures and just organize the space then I will sweep the carpet and clean uh, areas that are, uh, yeah, that are visible that don't have furniture. For the daily cleaning of my furniture, I always use a vinegar and water mixture because it is always in this spray bottle. Yeah, I always make sure this spray bottle has a vinegar and a water mixture uh, and uh, yeah, and uh, easily reachable. So that is what I use to clean my all my furniture. Yeah, so now I will be clean. I will be sweeping my carpet. I use this broom or another uh, uh, broom that uh, a scrubbing broom that I, I need to bend uh, low. But today I wasn't feeling like uh, bending, doing all the bendings. Yeah, so 
once in a while uh, twice a week or once a week i always get to spot clean this carpet and just to remove stains you know with kids in the house guys uh, you will always find stains everywhere so i prefer spot cleaning this carpet uh, with the astonish carpet cleaner it works magical if you have a carpet especially a bright carpet like mine and you have kids in the house or just you are alone and you can mess up at times you need that uh, cleaning product Guys, at times I receive uh, questions on how I manage to keep a clean home and I have kids. Guys, there's no secret other than just cleaning and cleaning, everyday cleaning, guys. Yeah, you can even clean twice a day. That, that is uh, by sweeping the carpets. Yeah, you can even sweep the carpet two or three times a day, especially when the kids are not in school. Yeah, so that is what we do just to make sure that we are in a, a clean space. And when your space is clean, you feel energized you feel so uh, happy yes you you just get into the mood of everything so that is what i do cleaning every day guys before my breakfast before showering before any other thing So guys, that is a, that is what I do on a daily basis before breakfast, before showering, before doing any other thing. And I always clean my balcony too, but I haven't shown you that. And my entrance door from outside, the caretaker does that. Though we do that once in a while, but our caretaker does that mostly. So uh, thank you so much for watching till this far. I hope that you learn how to clean, keep your houses clean. And uh, yeah, let me see you in my next one, guys. I love you always and uh, goodbye, guys. Yes.